Hey guys, today is Friday, June the 5th, and I got up this morning at 7 because I made a cake for my friend. He called me Wednesday and said, um, Bertie, can you make a cookie cake? And I said, let me buy, let me get the, see if I can get the ingredients, and if I can get the ingredients, then yeah, I can make you one. And so I got all the ingredients Wednesday afternoon, and then I made it this morning. I got up at 7 and made it this morning. And then he had to have it by 12. So he has it. Mm -hmm. It's for his daughter. I ended up making a cookie cake, cookie cake, and then I frosted it. I fonded it in it, and then I made it into, into kind of like a cell phone. It wasn't perfect, but I wish it could have been perfect. But I'm not that good with fondant, and I wasn't for. I'm not that good with fondant. It starts cracking on me. I'll have to get better at it. But here's God's glory box. I'm gonna do. April and June. They skip May because of the pandemic. So April and June. Hopefully they'll put on the tack at the end because I haven't paid for until October. I haven't been satisfied with them but um, I paid it for a year plus one so I'm paid up until October of 2020 so hopefully I'll get November since they didn't give us May. But it's God's Glory Box, and here's the new box that they, um, got, and, did I go all the way around? Alright, so, when you open it up, here's what it looks like. It says, Debbie's, uh, sponsored by Debbie's Homemade Happiness, Personalized Jewelry, Hashtag Wear Your Faith www.debbieshomemadehappiness.com and J. Callway uh, Lead with Dignity Oh, Diligence Lead with Diligence Be the person people want to follow at www.jcallway.com That's J-C-A-L-A-W-A-Y.com And so here is what is in the box and some coupons if you want to use those and then here's what it says on the back and then when you open it this is what it looks like so you get you get those little things Right now it's 1.45 and I gotta be at work at 2.45. I thought I would jump on here since I'm not supposed to unbox at work anymore. Okay, so the first thing that we'll pull out is the glasses. And it says, God is good all the time. That's what my uncle used to say. And then we got a key ring that says Luke 137, God never fails. God grown, I mean love grown spice. I think that's the, it says made with love, of love grown, grow, inspiration shop.com. And here's what it looks like. And then we got two downloads. We got two downloads. One to give and one to use. And it says Days of Healing. It says April comes with many holidays and um, observance that focus on health awareness, the arts, the arts and reading and community service. Easter is a celebration of the resurrection of Jesus. From the tomb on the third day from his uh, crucifixion, let's, let the resurrection of Jesus bring health and healing to you. 30, down, 30 days of devotionals of healing. Today's task, today's promise, today's devotional, today's prayers, 
today's encouragements and today's scriptures to write out. And then they gave a discount for a 15% a discount code um, at www.givingjesus.com. Then, from Silent Inspirations, paintings, cards, bookmarks, and blogs, www.silentinspiration.com, we got uh, two uh, cards. One to, these are to, um, to give um, so that you can uh, give people, you know, let people just know you care. And so here's what it looks like. And then inside it says, For thy Lord has made me glad through the works. I will triumph in the works of thy hand. Psalms 92.4 And then the back gives you the artist in brief detail. And then it comes with two cards and an envelope so that you can share your love. And then the final thing in here is I'm not used to having nails. Is the book the healer, the um, heart for prayer, a heart for prayer? Sorry, by C. J. Hertz. Twenty-one days of drawing close to Father God. It says on the back, "Do you desire to have a heart of prayer?" Psalms 27 8 says my heart has heard you say come and talk with me and my heart responds Lord I am coming our father God longs for his children to spend time with him having a heart of prayer is simply having a heart for relationships for relationship when we enjoy being with someone we find ourselves um, lingering in their presence one cup of coffee turns into two, and before we know it, we've lost track of time. That's the way it can be when we linger when we linger with our avid father. He's never in a hurry to leave and never grows impatient in walking for us. He's always excited when his children come running into his arms without pondering. Prayer is the proof that we were relying on Father God. When we come to him in prayer, we're saying, I love you, I need you, I want you to be with me. My hope is that each of these 21 days helps what we, helps with, I mean, helps with your appetite to enjoy a lifetime of sweet prayer with your Heavenly Father. May you find yourself agreeing with David in Psalms 34.8 taste and see what that the Lord is good oh the joy of those who take refuge in him that is so true though you know how it is when you are into when you're waiting for a phone call from somebody or or just when you haven't seen somebody in a long time and you just lose track of time um I have a friend and her name is Tara and that is her real name Tara and we, we don't see each other very often but when we do we don't we just talk and talk and talk and uh, we'll say oh let's go have lunch and then uh, lunch turns into three four hours <laughs> and like one time her guy friend called a, her guy friend called and said where are you at and she's like i'm having lunch with birdie and then he's like okay um i'll talk to you in a little bit and then she called back where are you at and she says i'm having lunch with birdie he says no you're not you've been there for almost two hours but yeah we usually close the joint down but so and I do know that, like, the more you talk to God, the more you start to hear his response. So, that right there shows you that the more time you spend with him, the more time you start to recognize his voice. Like, um, um, I heard once that, uh, but I'm not for sure where it's at in the Bible or if it is, but um, and my grandma used to say that, or you always heard that, um, the lamb knows the shepherd you know the lamb knows the shepherd's voice and um, so it's not deceived and so the more you talk to him and the more you acknowledge him the more that you will recognize him when he's talking to you like when he tells you don't do that because da 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 you know or when he says shut your mouth because you don't need to say that out loud you'll know that it's him and it's not just you thinking that you know that it's him telling you what and what not 
or when you're in prayer and you just want to cry because honestly guys you can be in your room meditating and um and know that the holy spirit is with you know that jesus christ is with you because you'll start to you'll start to feel comfort and your heart will be lifted up and 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 sometimes you'll cry but it's not sadness crying it's joyful crying because you finally realize what you have to do and you don't have to take words to him you just have to say lord you know what i'm going through please just take care of it and he'll start working on it but you have to ask him sometimes you have to clarify him that i need you to take this problem and forget about it because he's going to take care of it in his own time when it is right for you because sometimes guys we have to learn from what we're going through because some of us don't learn we just don't learn not at all some of us just are stubborn okay off my rant now god's glory box for june and here it is you know we uh donate a thousand meals per year five hundred thousand um this far giving jesus and it says givingjesus.com when we open it here's what it looks like inside and then here is a little note from god's glory box and then here is everything that is in there and discount codes all right the first thing is from www.sday.com shop smittens design and right here and it is a chain that says the joy uh, the joy in the Lord is our strength and here's what it says. And then when you open it, oh. sorry. Oh. I don't want to find that later tonight in my bed. Okay. She doesn't have it on the tag just yet so here's what it looks like and then here's what it looks like on the back and then here it is. and then the chain is just those links And then you can just put that on there. Just sit on like that. It's kind of sticky. But I'll put that back in there. I might put my friend's ring on that. I tell you I made a cookie cake today and never made one before i used to always think that a cookie cake was like at walmart and it was really thin and it was a cookie but this one turned out thick and moist and good and then the second thing is 99 percent alcohol 91 percent um um olivera and it is called unicorn hand sanitizer by A M N H W dot A M I N N A H dot com and here it is. Do you see? And there. Is that? And then have I not commanded you be strong and uh, cur cur courageous? Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Joshua 1 9. Isn't that pretty? And here's who it's from. And 
Okay, it went off. So, days of honoring motherhood, 30 days of devotionals for honoring mothers, today's uh, task, today's promise, today's devotional, today's prayer, today's encouragement, and today's scriptures to write it uh, to write out. And that was that. And then the last one. Sorry about that. We'll go. I'm not for sure what happened, but. And on the bottom of the box, it says, Our mission to spread God's glory, promoting small Christian artists, creators, and businesses, and donating don't, and donate a thousand meals per year to feedingamerica.com, www.godsglorybox.com. But the book we got in this one is this right here. And it said, Sacred Walk. Sacred Walk of Motherhood, a 21-day journal by Ashley Booth, B-U-F-E, with uh, contributions from Ginger Hughes and Sherry White, and artwork by uh, Stevie Swift. And then it's a journal, and this one kind of looks cool because I've already looked in it. And it looks like my old book that I used to get from um, that Bible book I used to get. A journaling deal. I can't remember what her name was anymore. But she used to do a really great Bible devotional deal once a month. But it just, I used to really like it. I got three months. And uh, I liked it. But she started getting careless. Just like Ash. Just like uh, Christy. But yeah, so that's what it looks like. And do I like the smell of it? I'm kind of weird. Okay, on the back it says, "Her children arise, rise, arise. Um, her children rise up and call her blessed. Her husband also, and he praiseth, praises, praiseth her. Many daughters have done." Um, virtuous many daughters have done virtuous versus verse virtuously but they're but thou excellence excellence them all favor is discreetful favor is and beauty is vain but a woman with that feareth the Lord uh, she shall be praised. Proverbs 31, 28, 30. It seems that the Proverbs 31 woman is who so many of us moms strive to be like. But motherhood is hard. And so often it feels like a matter, no matter how hard we strive, we will never quite reach that go. It is my prayer that the journal will be an, be an encouragement to you to show you that God is walking this journey with you that he chose you he handpicked you to be the mother to your children I pray that you will utilize the journal pages as a way to be intentional with your prayers and goals and that you will enjoy the beautiful artwork as you write these scriptures um, on your heart um, that's kind of true if God blessed you with a baby he didn't bless me with a baby if he blessed you with a baby he had a purpose for you to have that baby even if you are a, a mother of a baby that you gave up for adoption he gave you that baby so that you could bless a mother that can't have a baby and uh, to be a mother so don't feel bad if you gave up your child because there was a reason that he gave you that child so that you could give it to somebody else um, and so um, so we are all meant to be where God put us because he made us he had a purpose for us before you were even born so y'all have a great day and I'll talk to y'all later bye guys